This is the other one I was going to talk about in a minute, it's quite important, this is the third one. It's about your immune system. One of the things that, I, that I'm constantly having to do to explain to people is that for the first two weeks of any cycle anyway, and it's best to say throughout the whole chemo experience, you don't have an immune system, as you know. So you're liable to catch anything. Um, and some things like flu and temperature and breathlessness are life-threatening and they have to ring 999 for an ambulance because if your partner drives you, the hospital aren't prepared, they're not ready, so you have to get an ambulance so that they can look after you in the ambulance and the hospital's expecting you. So the moment you get there, it just goes, you go straight to the system um, or else you're uh, likely to die. So it is really quite life-threatening. But explaining that to people, they think, uh, yeah, right, yeah, well, um, I'm just getting over a cold, so that'd be all right. Or um, no, I, I've got a little bit of flu, but no, no, I, I can't come near you. I, go away. I can't. I'm sorry. I just can't do it. It's not easy to explain to people. They just don't really understand. I, I was invited to um, a pub quiz Saturday night. I really wanted to go, but I couldn't because if I was in there and someone on the table next to me suddenly sneezed, oh, I'd have to get up and go. So it's risking things. I can't go into crowded places, can't go into pubs or, or shops and so forth. So it just has to be out and about certainly and maybe empty premises if there's nobody else there, as long as I can get out the door quickly and I'm with someone who can pay for me. <laughs> um, but this pub quiz is an example. I was invited by three different people to go to this quiz and I had to explain to all three of them that I couldn't because of that. As it happened it was a ploughman's lunch and it was brie which I can't have, um, pate which I'm not allowed to have um, and, and blue cheese which I'm not allowed to have and a couple of other things I forget now that are on the list of things that are too dangerous to eat because they, um, they've got bacteria in them and the bacteria, like blue cheese, I've got no defence against it, so anything can happen with that. Chances are nothing may happen, but you just cannot risk it, because it's you, at the end of the day, it's your life. They actually had a question I wanted to work, I walked past the hall, and uh, the question was, a light year is a measurement of, and I, I, know that, I know that one, I know that one, but I felt like running in and shouting distance. Um, I wouldn't have been too popular, but I, I didn't, I restrained and I spoke to someone afterwards and I did get the answer correct, although there was a lot of discussion apparently. Many people disagreed and thought it was something else. But the purpose of this is, you just have to explain to people that you have no immune system. I have no immune system. I can't go out for a drink in a pub with them. Uh, I can't meet in a shopping centre, I can't go to shops and it's very very difficult because many people think you're overreacting and just being a bit silly in the prima donna but I'm not, I just can't do it, it's, it's, it's just the way it is. Well that's, uh, ten day, that's 14 days now and my next chemo is next Wednesday and I'll probably do a little bit then. <laughs>